Catalytic converter thefts are on the rise in Greensboro. Criminals are after the exhaust control device that's under your vehicle for the precious metals inside that can come at a high price. And it seems like no driver is off limits. More than a dozen converters were stolen off UPS trucks over the weekend. Now Greensboro police are investigating who cut them off. Fox 8's Tyler Harden joins us live outside the UPS distribution facility off Industrial Avenue. And Tyler, this crime really adds up. It really can. Each catalytic converter can cost you up to $1,000 or more. And here at UPS, 15 of their trucks were targeted on Sunday night. Some of those trucks as new as 2022 models. But they're not the only business here in this area that's feeling the effects of the crime. This crime is all too common for business owners along Industrial Avenue in Greensboro. If you leave your car overnight, which I did this summer and went out of town, and when I came back, my catalytic converter was gone. In minutes, Jean Hoag's catalytic converter was stolen out from under her Toyota FJ Cruiser in February. They scout the neighborhood. They find the cars they want, and they wanted a car there. These pictures captured the thief in the front of her business on Manufacturer's Road. They just get under there, cut them out, and take off. She didn't realize something was wrong until she started her SUV. So loud. I mean, I hated to drive it up the street to the muffler place. You'll know if you're just stolen. All these people in this area are going through the same things. Les Werner's catalytic converter went missing yeah, on his Lincoln Continental December 5th. This surveillance video shows someone walking away with it around 3.30 in the morning. Doubles my mechanics work and inconveniences all. But... Now his workplace, UPS, was hit too on December 26th. 15 trucks are left idle until new catalytic converters are installed, and getting one isn't cheap. This is easily another $800 to $1,000 after you add everything up. Automobile accessory thefts, including catalytic converters, have almost doubled this year. Greensboro Police report 1,091 cases in 2021 so far, compared to 636 in 2020. Gene and Les are calling for those responsible to be put behind bars. They've got to hold these people accountable. We can't just let criminals keep running the streets and doing what they want and not making them accountable. The, there's got to be a bail so they don't get right back out and do it again. So there is a new law on the books that makes stealing a catalytic converter a class one felony here in North Carolina. You can also be slapped with a $1,000 fine. Now, I did reach out to UPS for a comment so far. I've not heard back yet. Live in Greensboro tonight, Tyler Harden, Fox 8 News.